What's going on YouTube? I know it's been a minute. I apologize. I apologize. I apologize. Uh, I haven't done very many vlogs recently. Uh, kind of transitioned the channel last year and the year before towards more towards the racing side of stuff, uh, which will continue. Uh, we are, you know, about ready to get into the racing season again, so there'll be plenty more race videos. Um, so I apologize. I apologize in advance for not uh, for not posted more content uh, you know just life happens I've been so busy between work and uh, just having fun I kind of got I'm not gonna say burnt out in terms of a uh, burned out for video creation because I didn't that's not what I got burned out doing uh, I got a little bit of burned out from editing not not terribly but just a little bit but more so than anything I just I was so busy trying to create content that I think it was kind of affecting uh, my actual enjoyment of the stuff that I was doing. Um, so I wanted to focus on just having fun, just being in, being in the moment, being present uh, with doing some of these things. But, you know, then I, <laughs> recently I look back and I, you know, I have so many good memories of things that happened last year and I can't go back and watch them. And then it's like, man, I, I wish I was shooting video for that so I could go back and watch it. And, and most importantly is, is, you know, I want to have those memories captured and recorded, and I want you guys to be able to kind of uh, enjoy them with me. Uh, I have a lot of uh, toys and stuff that can bring a lot of great adventures, dirt bikes. I got a boat last year, so we'll do some boating stuff this year. And uh, what the purpose of this video is, is we're actually headed over to uh, my dad's office now where I'm keeping this item that I want to show you guys here. Um, there's some things I want to install, uh, which will add some adventures for this season, uh, which will be awesome. Um, I just recently picked up a new GoPro Hero 10 uh, with the Volta mod and Media mod, so I'll be able to record a lot easier, a lot smaller footprint. I still have all my other camera gear and stuff. I've got a Hero 7 Black, a Hero 4, so lots of GoPro action as always. I, and I also have the uh, uh, Canon, the DSLR, um, so I'll be able to shoot content on that. Still will do race day stuff. I'll do all my race videos as normal. But this year, I also want to add some actual race day vlog style videos uh, with some B-roll and some other stuff besides just me racing. Uh, bring some other racers to get involved, use some of their footage, do some B-roll. And I picked up a new DJI Mavic 2, uh, which is the drone. I used to have the Mavic Pro a couple years ago, which I got rid of. Uh, but I did pick up another drone, the Mavic Air 2, so I'll have some drone footage. So again, I'm back in the game, guys. I'm back fully committed again. Uh, I want to bring lots of adventure vlogs to you. Uh, sorry, guys, I'm driving, so I got to pay attention to the road a little bit. Uh, we're getting close to my dad's office now. So, um, but yeah, I, I want to uh, I want to get back into video making, and that's kind of the purpose of what this is kind of uh, this video is about on top of showing you guys what I have brought to the table for this year. So uh, I will continue to drive. I'll be back here when we get to my dad's office and we'll do the reveal with what I'm trying to show you guys. I appreciate you guys hanging out with the channel. Uh, you know, it means so very much to me. The channel did grow a little bit uh, on some race day videos that I posted, not very big. We're still eight, about 1800 members strong. So I appreciate you guys hanging out, uh, but hopefully we'll grow the channel some more with some video content this year with some of the stuff that I have planned. So hang tight, guys, and we'll be back here very shortly. You could try to play, but you're never gonna beat me. Look the other way, what I'm doing ain't easy. Bloody hands stain from the people who deceive me. Muddy hands break through the chains, go free me. Looking for change, looking for pain. Pulling a mob, pushing a train. I'll never stop, stick to a lane. Pick up the pieces and go rearrange. Uh, I'll be the best above all the rest, put me to the test. Uh, Expect nothing less, you check as I'm chess, what's happening next, yeah. He got the venom, a tangible weapon, no coming in second, this life is a lesson He got a new engine from pain, it's a blessing, new focus, no guessing, just bold an obsession All in his possession, you got the retention, I'll leave it 2020 Spark Tricks Sea-Doo um, This is the 3-of edition I have the BRP audio system with it uh, That is not on here, it's at home I took it home with me. The cover doesn't really sit on it with the audio system. Plus it's completely waterproof and needs to be charged. So I took it home just to have the charger and to keep the cover on it, which I've taken off currently. Uh, great, great uh, little unit. I'm excited for it. It's like a dirt bike on the water, which kind of fits for what we can do. Um, it has the, it is the Trix edition. So it has the uh, variable trim system uh, that allows you to change the direction of the propulsion, I believe. Uh, but what ultimately what it allows you to do is 
uh, adjust the the height that it, when you take off it allows you to do what they call st like wheelies essentially they call them stand-ups or something like that uh, just because it's in the water and doesn't have wheels um, yeah I'm excited haven't uh, haven't had a chance to use it yet um, I bought it this winter and we're still at 40 degrees outside so um, Hopefully within a month or two, we'll be able to get her out on the water. Uh, the boat will be going into the water in the next month or so uh, to get stationed at its dock. So uh, between the boat and the jet ski, hopefully we have quite a bit of adventures. It has the adjustable handlebars as well. So you can adjust the height of the handlebars, which, uh, which is a pretty nice feature. The variable trim system also has IBR, which is intelligent braking and uh, reverse which is nice function to have. And then it comes with the Triton trailer, which it's all aluminum, which is a nicer trailer. Uh, super happy. So yeah, uh, once again, guys, I appreciate uh, this quick little video. Just wanted to update you guys and uh, let you know that I apologize for not posting more content sooner. Um, again, I just was a little burnt out, but I'm back, hopefully, uh, get going here again. Um, I got a couple other videos this off season that I've done um, that I want to talk about uh, that'll be coming up here soon. Uh, one of the biggest things was a big weight loss challenge that I needed to do. I was getting a little bit chubby, uh, a little bit's probably a, uh, a friendly way of saying it. I was getting fat. Um, so between last season and this season, I have lost about 35 pounds. So I've just, just crusted under 200 pounds again. So that's exciting. So hopefully this race season, I will uh, be a lot more competitive because I'm a little more, uh, more weight friendly. But I'm going to get this put away because it is starting to rain here. And I will get in the car and we will talk about some of the future videos coming up. Muddy and stain from the people who deceive me Muddy hands break through the chains, go free me People like sheep move feet, hurt it easy Sorry, a um, little out of breath here um, See, <laughs> I just realized every time I uh, start to talk to you guys for the first time in however long uh, So much has changed in the things that I have Like this is a new truck to me um, that I got last year It's a 2018 Ram uh, 2500 diesel uh, Again Got to pay to play sometimes, and when you got the kind of toys that I have, I wanted to make sure that I had something that was capable of pulling it. Um, I bought a fifth wheel toy hauler, a 37 foot Puma, um, that I'll want to do a walk around with you guys, um, and show you guys that a little bit. That'll probably work more towards track season when I get it pulled out. Or uh, here in a couple weeks from when I'm recording this, I don't know when I'm gonna get this edited. Hopefully I get it edited pretty soon. Um, I am going to be on a, going on a dirt bike trip with Shorty Moto, um, my sponsor, Turn 13 Motorsports, Jake Brown. He is going to come with us, amongst other people, Jeff Fargo, which you guys have seen in plenty of other videos on my channel. Uh, he's the guy on the CBR 954. He'll be coming. We're going to go do a dirt bike trip down to Wayne on the 23rd of April. So I'll be doing some footage of that, uh, recording, doing a whole weekend vlog on that, along with some riding footage and any other shenanigans that are going to happen that night. Because you know when we, all of us guys get together, the craziness that happens. So. Oh. oh, my God. Toby's down. Good. Uh, so yeah, so I will be doing uh, that dirt bike trip. Uh, so that'll be another video. I want to talk about my weight loss journey, uh, some things that I've done to, to lose about 30 pounds. So like I said yesterday, when I weighed myself, I was fine at 196.4 pounds from 233 pounds. So almost 40 pounds in the journey with that. So I want to talk a little bit about that with you guys because uh, I'm very proud of that. Um, that was a very difficult thing to do and it was a very dedicated thing to do. And I want to continue that. Um, not necessarily weight loss journey because now that I'm 195, that was my target. Um, obviously losing a little bit more weight may be beneficial, uh, but I don't necessarily, I, I, I just want to stay healthy, stay fit, stay eating well, uh, just for overall health more than anything. So, um, I want to do my, you know, I want to show you guys the DJI Mavic, uh, Air 2 or DJI Mavic 2 Pro or whatever. I don't know exactly how they named it. 
Um, I want to show you guys that. I'll show you this guys. I'll show you this setup because it's pretty cool if I haven't already. Um, that's another video. Then obviously race season is going to be starting here in the next couple weeks. I want to do race day vlogs that uh, maybe some interviews, some just some cinematic stuff at the track, um, some overhead uh, views of racing and practice and how the weekends go and just the shenanigans that go on during the race weekend, uh, boat stuff, jet ski stuff, I'm on all that kind of ventures I, I want to bring to you guys this season. Uh, so yeah, so that's the plan for the uh, the season, guys. So I appreciate you guys. Apologize, I'm gonna to try to jump in front of this car here, so I got to, had to pay attention there. Um, I appreciate you guys hanging out with me, uh, sticking around with me, as I've mentioned earlier in this video. It, you know, it means so very much to me that uh, uh, that you guys didn't abandon the channel. Hopefully, um, I'll make it worth your time and make it worth your uh, your investment. Uh, and show you guys some great fun content uh, and obviously if I know you guys and uh, you guys are local you know I'd love to have you guys come out and have fun with me um, so yeah we'll broach that topic as we get there uh, but anyway guys I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here I'm heading back to the house uh, go get my let my wife uh, she's got to run some errands and I'm on dog duty for the evening so um, thanks again as always guys I appreciate it and remember to enjoy the moment as I always used to say and until the next video guys we'll catch you guys later peace Break through the chains, go free me People like sheep, move feet, hurt it easy You don't wanna be fast asleep when they scheme in Better stay tall, ready for a fight, believe me When they try the chains, you can say no, free me